Why does my hair think that it can do that? Like, what is that? It's 7.08 in the morning. Um, to me, this is so early. Since daylight savings has happened, I just can't get up at an early hour. I don't really know what's wrong with me, but it just doesn't work anymore. I used to be able to get up at like 6.30 and be totally fine, but like I normally sleep until 11 now. That's how bad daylight savings has got me. I'm going to my studio to spin. I'm gonna train and practice my playlist because um, I, like I'm not at that level yet where I can just be like, oh, I know what I'm gonna do and then spin to it. I mean, I might be at that level, but I don't know. I don't wanna find out. Oh, and the vlogs, by the way, are back by popular, popular, popular demand. You're welcome. It is all about the layers, okay? This is what it looks like when you don't have a proper winter coat. You have to layer it up. I have my old row sweatshirt. Every time I wear this, people are like, where is it from? Um, I don't know, my friend and Katie ordered it for me. Um, and then this is a sweatshirt, zip up underneath of it. See the hood? Then I have my tank top on, sports bra, sweats, and then underneath that is my workout pants and Uggies. I made it, but I'm not taking my sweatshirt off for like, I don't know, a while. I'm so cold still. Is it ever like so early in the morning that nothing works for you? Like I literally couldn't, why did I just do that? Like I knew that there was water in my swell still and I still did that. I guess that shows uh, how early it is. I can't even tell you how many times I've spilled water from transferring a water bottle into my swivel. Better. I read, like when I read Skinny Bitch a while ago, they talked about fasting in it. And I was always sort of like, how do you not eat for an entire day? Like, I love food. How do you do that? And then we had this snowstorm that hit the other day. And all I was doing was eating. And I literally feel like I just have so much crap in my body. And um, so there's this girl that goes here to the studio. And I was like, hey, like a while ago on Instagram, you said that you were doing like a cleanse. Like, what do you do for your cleanse? She's oh, I fast. I'm like, oh, like for how long? She said, just one day. But she said it really like cleans her out and it really works. So I'm gonna try to fast today. Knowing me, I probably will fail because I'm so hungry already, but I'm gonna try to. So let's see how that goes. I'm gonna put my headset on. One of my favorite things to do is spin to my favorite song at the moment. And this is my instinct and it's like a really good warm up song. So I never stop doing it, it's gonna be really good. So yeah, that was a little bit of me spinning. I had like extra spin clips that I also inserted from like two weeks ago or something like that. So yeah, that was me training to spin. Now I'm headed home. Um, like I'm probably gonna eat today. Like I don't know why I think fasting is a good idea. I mean, I can understand the benefits of it, 
but I just am hungry and I just want to eat. I'm almost home right now and then there's like three big boxes that I have to take out to the trash because I got um, a bed and we had to like assemble it so it has three giant boxes and I'm like I'm bundled up now I may as well do it now and uh, be a little productive with my morning. That last box was so hard. I don't know how people do a fast because I definitely cannot. This is apples with peanut butter, Kite Hill dairy-free vegan yogurt, and a little bit of granola. So I just took a shower. It is 11.22. And I'm going to lunch with my mom at noon. She's picking me up. Every Thursday, her and I go to lunch. Um, and I've been meaning to vlog it every single time that we've done it. Um, but we just, I never have brought my camera. I forgot. The last few times have been kind of sucky. Like we went to this like really good Mexican place one time and then we went to this really good vegan cafe one time. Oh, I put that one in a vlog. Um, and we went to this one other really good place that had like really good roasted veggies and stuff. Um, but the last two weeks have been kind of like a fail. Last week we went to this place that our family friend like loves. We didn't really like it. And then the week before that we went to like a vegan little place and it was just weird. Like the whole vibe was like super, super weird. So we didn't really like it there. And this week we aren't going like to a proper restaurant. We're going to Honey Grow, which is a chain restaurant. And there's one that opened up in King of Prussia and I'm like, oh, hell yes. And I've been suggesting it for the past like four weeks. And my mom's always like, like, no, like, let's just go there another time. But because we like to go on, if you guys are familiar with like Philly, like suburb area, we like to go to the main line a lot for lunch and stuff. We also love house hunting. So we like to look at the houses when we go and we just like to drive by because they're like huge houses. They're like castles, like legit, like $23. $23 million mansion castle houses on the main line. So we like to go and like look at them and stuff. Not like go in them, just drive by and stuff and see that. So we do like to go on the main line a lot. But um, yeah, this time we're going to Honey Grow. Oh, also I'm a totally different color because I'm wearing a sweatshirt today. So I'm just going to um, fake my tan. We're going to a local grocery market. Um, I love going there for like my groceries and it's like all organic and stuff. So we go there for our groceries and then I'm going to a farmer's market afterwards for my produce. Fast forward several hours and here we are. Um, I just got back from lunch and then I went grocery shopping with my mom. So I'll show you guys what I got grocery shopping. And I'll show you guys kind of what I do after I grocery shop. Um, because I do kind of do a lot after I grocery shop to kind of meal prep and make everything a little bit easier for myself. Um, also, I just want to quickly say that I finally found this kombucha. I normally drink the Synergy kombucha. 
but I've wanted to try this one for so long and I found it so I'm, I'm really happy about that that I found it and I love it I think it tastes so good and there's something about like the bottle top how it's like skinny it like really makes a huge difference because I don't know you can drink in the car all right so this is all the goods that I got um, normally I go to the farmer's market every Thursday and Sunday and get my stuff for the weekend and then for the week until Thursday again. Um, and then I only have to go to the actual grocery store like once every two weeks or so to restock on stuff that isn't like fresh produce. So, I mean, with the farmer's market, it's normally like $25 for all of this. And then this depends. Today it was expensive because I had booch and oils which oils kind of add up to a lot um so yeah that kind of made it pretty pricey but normally like average out like a w every week it's like fifty dollars just for me so i got these purely elizabeth i'm like super excited to try these i'm gonna try it now actually so anything that's like vegan and chocolate granola like all my granola is vegan chocolate mm, so yum this is what i'm drinking now i mean eating now Mm, it's not very good. This. This is bomb. This is not very good. But I sweetened it up with agave. This is really good though. Two more health aid booches. Um, I ran out of olive oil, so I needed that. I got avocado oil. Um, yeah, I got that. Kite Hill cream cheese. My bag literally just fell over. Kite Hill cream cheese is the best for dairy-free girls out there, vegan people, whatever. This is the best. It tastes just like original chive cream cheese. It's so yum. I got almond butter. This is my favorite hummus. I used to love Sabra, and then I started using this. And it is so yummy. And look at those ingredients. Amazing. Can't even see. It wasn't even focused. Um, I love vegan yogurt. This is my favorite, this brand. Um, I've tried a bunch of different brands, but this one is definitely, definitely, definitely the best. Um, this is my mom's bread. She forgot to bring it home. But yeah, it's um, spelt. It's a different kind of grain. And then I got this bread. I've been meaning to try a different bread. Um, Plant-based and egg-free. Vegan. I don't know. I'm kind of iffy about it. I'm kind of iffy about most breads, but kind of long list of ingredients. But we'll see. Um, moving on to produce. I got three avocados bag of spinach. I love these in acai bowls. Some bloobs. Um, two mangoes. I thought I got three. Remember, I guess my mom took one. Two mangoes. These are like huge mangoes, by the way. Like so big. Like so big. Um, sweet potatoes. I roast these all the time. I'm going to roast them in a few, so I love those. I got kiwis. Lemons because I like making lemon water in the morning. Um, like hot lemon water it detoxes your body, so I love that. Bananas, I eat so many bananas. This is kind of like a low stock for me, actually. It was five pounds for $2, so I was like, oh, hell yes. These are apples. Those are honey crisp. some of my faves. Um, strawberries, broccoli, onions. Those are my mom's. She forgot them. Baby carrots and hearts of romaine. Before I put any of this away, I like to go through and like clean out my fridge, my cabinets, and put all of that stuff in like my grocery bags and then take that out to the trash. So yeah, I know I'm kind of bad at vlogging, but um, that was pretty much my day. After that, I just got some sushi with my bestie, Natalie, and um, that was it. So yeah, um, I know you guys really want these vlogs. I'm gonna get better at vlogging, I swear, and I'm gonna like try my best to do it more. But um, yeah, I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I know this isn't my usual content, but um, I figured since everyone on my main channel asks for vlogs, I may as well put one up here on my main channel. If you guys want me to continue on my main channel or on my vlog channel, let me know. Um, but yeah, I love you guys, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.